Hey, Aaron, what impressed you most about that Houdini act that Chapman just pulled? Um, just, just the continued uh, focus on making pitches. You know, Vladdy kind of fought that first one off, and and Tay Oscar, you know, didn't really hard hit him, but did a good job of just shooting it the other way and put and set themselves up, obviously, in great position. I thought he made a lot of really good pitches to Gritchick to get the strike out and then and then handled his position. You know, I got rid of the ball a little quick to home, um, but a nice play to 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 stop the comebacker, obviously. And then I thought Gurriel threw a really good at bat against him, was really competitive. But I think what Chappie had going was his stuff was good. He was throwing strikes. So he was getting himself into good counts there and he kept making pitches. And he was a little unpredictable too. And, and even though Gurriel had a really good at bat, he saw some really good heaters, saw some really good splits too. So um, I just thought he, he continued to, to keep his focus and just concentrate on making pitches against a team, giving him some really tough at bats. Knowing how good that offense can be over there, just how tense was that dugout in the nice? Oh, those games are, those games are always tense, right? I mean, you know, one run games, back to back games here. Um, you know, obviously they got runners out there on base tying and go ahead run. So those are, those are tense moments in the game. And, you know, one of the reasons you put this uniform on is to be a part of those. Clearly Chapman has been good for you all season long. Cole, still throwing hard at the end of that eighth inning. Was there any consideration to, to letting him go out there in that eighth? In, in the ninth? I'm sorry, the ninth. I apologize, the ninth. Uh, yeah, uh, no, no. I feel like he really emptied the tank there in that eighth. Uh, you, you saw 101, or I, I looked up on the scoreboard and saw 101 on one of them. His last pitch was a changeup, his hardest changeup that he's probably thrown all year. So I think it was really him just emptying the tank. I was kind of going one base runner at a time at that point. But um, no, I felt like that was the end of the line for him there in the eighth. We'll take the next one from Brendan Cuddy. Aaron, was that a foul ball? Sorry. Uh, the, the, the foul ball against uh, Gurriel. What, was your, what oh. was your view of that play? I wasn't sure. I, I just, I was watching CB right away. And I, when I saw him do that, then obviously I knew it was a foul ball and one of those things you can't review, you just got to get together as a crew. So it was, we weren't sure on our side. And just with what Gary is doing right now to, to see him do it again tonight, just what's, I guess, what's your, what's your reaction to that? Just happy for him. Cause he's, he's worked so hard. He's just kept his nose down. Obviously he lost some playing time, you know, about a month ago and just has kept working been a great teammate um you know he's worked really hard on both sides of the ball i th thought he did a great job coming in and catching had some really good blocks there in that ninth inning and obviously a good throw to get the the out at third base and obviously a huge swing um so his work he, he's just worked and he's he's had the courage to make adjustments and uh you know he's he's getting some of the rewards now <laughs> 